Okay, so this is called. <laughs> so this story that Zay wrote is called The Darkwing Dussy. <laughs> Welcome back to the video for you guys. Girl, wrong channel, wrong channel. What do you mean? It's the wrong channel, babe. Okay, hola, como estas? Bienvenue a la YouTube Chan Chan. I'm here with a special guest. No special guest, a celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> Let's fix that. I did. You didn't. I did. But you didn't. I did. Okay, but you didn't. Today, we are actually in Canada because I wanted to show him what it's like. So I actually flew him out to Ontario, my homeland. And it sucks here. First of all, America smells like pee. Before we get into it, I need y'all to back me up on this one. He has a southern accent. He no, I don't. No, I literally don't. Okay. You do. You do. Let me explain. First explain. of all, let me introduce myself. Hi, <laughs> Miss. Um, if you don't know me, my name is Martin. Miss. I'm from South Carolina, but I just don't have that accent. You and she swears I have the accent, but like, I you literally do. don't. This morning he was like, "Let's take a nap, girl." No, I didn't. <laughs> Texas. That's not me, baby. You, Wrong okay. person. I'm just saying, throughout this video, mm -hmm. just listen to what he has to say and oh, tell me okay. he doesn't have an accent. For today's video, we are going to be writing our own <laughs> Wattpad story. Ah! I searched up random cartoon character generator online and it's going to generate for us. We have 10 minutes and then after that 10 minutes is up, we're going to switch and read them to each other. Yours yeah. better be good. Yours better be good. Oh, good. When it comes down to me, Martin, it's always gonna be good. What do you know about Wattpad? I definitely was a Wattpad kid a little bit when I was younger, oh. but Wattpad's changed. It has. It's not eyes, it's orbs. <laughs> you did not just say <laughs> it's that. It's orbs. Random cartoon characters generator mix. Your character is gonna be. Wait, I don't, what is that? I've never know. seen that before. <laughs> See Wait, that? I've never seen that. What is that? I don't know who that is. But this is giving like Mafia Boss, like Darkwing Duck. Like, oh. quack, quack, like. <laughs> he took off his cape. Yeah, Wait. And he quacked at me, like, quack, quack. <laughs> I kind of like it, because you don't know anything about him. I don't, so I'm going to make him up, like, and to be like, he's going to be like, bad. He's going to kidnap. Okay. <laughs> he's going to kidnap. He's going to kidnap. Okay. And he's going to eat this badussi. Oh. oh. Can I see Queen. <laughs> Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Yes. How ready are you? I'm very ready. If you're ready, you have to tell me I'm cute. <laughs> <laughs> waiting. I'm literally Stop. waiting. Okay. <laughs> I'm still waiting. Batman. No fair. No, no, we need to switch. No, we need to switch. Uh, stop it. I like the idea of us not knowing like, who they are. Okay, yeah. we'll do another one for you. Corky Pay. <laughs> he gives me the vibe like he'll like make out with you cutely. I feel like he'll be freaky in bed. Oh yeah, because he loves blink, you. Blink. Stop! <laughs> it's okay. Giving blink. Okay, blink. I'm gonna do Porky Pig. Oh my god. I'm excited! Okay, okay. I'm gonna set my timer. When it ends, we're gonna hear that. Oh, we should do this one. It's that one. Oh, he Are you ready for this? Yes, I'm so excited. I'm excited too. Okay, hands off. <laughs> We're done. I need to prove it. No, no, we have to admit. I have to come out no, of no. <laughs> no, no wrong. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> Yours is like, oh, in story story mode. Yeah. I have my quotation, so you should be able to figure out. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of mm. grammatical errors, because sometimes I think faster than I type. Lots of grammatical errors. So I'll be missing errors. words. Who do you want to read first? I want to read yours first. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and I'm a great reader, so let's see what we got. So what's your story called? Okay. Oh, I don't have a title. Okay. <laughs> wow, a real Wattpad queen would understand okay. that there's always a title. I'm gonna call it House Down. <laughs> and 
<laughs> what? That, okay, this is pretty interesting. <laughs> Be patient with me, please. All right. I'm can... so embarrassed. Like, this is embarrassing. This is called House Down, Read It R, Read With Me. There he was. Flash me that familiar smile. I guess I should probably introduce myself. Well, I'm Miss Picky. I go to college at Pixton University, and I'm a sophomore. Oh, and I'm also in love with the student council president. Forgive me. <laughs> Wait, what? We've been best friends since we were little, and most importantly, he was there for me when my mother left us. Aww. Motherless. He's been my best friend for years, but that will soon have to come to an end when he leaves for California at the end of the school year. Aww. In the hallways. I walk through the rinse and- <laughs> Why did I use pungent? I just punched it in my story. Uh, I can't wait to leave this place. All of a sudden, I feel a warm hand grab my waist and pulls me into the janitor's. What the hell? <laughs> I'm not sure who this but. Who this is? I'm not sure who this but by. Y'all catch this. <laughs> but by the roughness of the hand, I know it's a man. The minute I pull it into the closet, everything goes dark. Even though my senses are heightened, I see nothing. I hear nothing. The only thing my body seems to notice is the hot, shaky breath against my left ear. Aside from that, it's quiet. I immediately snap out of my confused daze and begin to swing my arms, hoping to hit somewhere where it hurts. My tints are clearly in vain, seeing how my hands quickly begin to hurt, punching against his hard body. What is this guy made of? <laughs> seeing how my tints are punching him were unsuccessful, I get to fling my legs in all different directions. I guess it's good that the lights are off or else I would have looked like a complete hooligan. I swing my right leg as hard as I can and it lands on something firm. Um, chill. As I ready my stance to launch another... Wait, yours is really... No, just keep going. Okay. Back. As I <laughs> to launch another kick into him, he grabs by my wrist and pulls my hand up against the wall with one hand. His other hand landing on my lips. Iggy, it's me. Were you big? A sigh of relief leaves my mouth and my body becomes weaker under his strong grasp. What are you doing? I ask in a breathless haze. I I, I wanted to tell you something. You know, before I leave for California. I pause, waiting for him to continue, but he remains there. His breath slowly gazing against my neck. I feel his body come closer. His lips not inches apart from mine. Porky Pedig- Pennington, I wanted to add his full name, like, you know this Oh! Is? James Edward Prince, get over here, I thought- Porky Pennington, spit it out before I- He stops me before I can even finish what I'm saying and parts my lips with him. <gasps> I'm not sure what's going on, but I'd be lying if I said this isn't something I've always dreamed of. Porky pushes my waist up against his and kisses me hard. A tongue spike for dominance as his hand grabs- Oh my god! This is so good! No, this no, is so good! Right Our tongue spike for dominance as his hand grabs the back of my neck, forcing our bodies to become even closer. I feel Porky's pig members grow and he ab abruptly- <laughs> Girl, what the f The spelling is bad. This is, okay. This um, is it's something. No! Abruptly pulls Abruptly? away. Abruptly? Are you sure? He's still catching his breath. I've never been more sure in my life, I say. With both his hands around my snatched way. Okay. <laughs> Porky walks my backwards. Me backwards. I'm oh. sorry. Walks me backwards until my back is up against the wall. I hear his pants on the camera. And I quickly lift up my skirt. Porky lifts my leg and gazes his hands against my upper thigh. His hands continue to travel my wet fold. <laughs> what? Wait, these wet folds? <laughs> these. Is that what they call it? <laughs> oh my god. My breath hitches and he kisses me again, even harder than the first time. Porky's thumb rests just below my navel as two fingers begin to explore my insides. <laughs> mouth moves from mine and travels to my earlobe while planting slow like kisses against my burning skin. Perky throws his hands inside his skin pot and I bit my lip trying to stop myself from making too much noise. His fingers leave my body and I quickly hear a quick slurping and sucking sound. You taste so good! <laughs> stop the Oh my god. Knock knock knock. <laughs> 
hello, who's in there? I know feeling the voice from outside yells. My heart drops and I quickly roll my skirt up and I hear him zip up his pants. He plants a quick kiss on my cheek and whispers in my ear. I'll be back to finish what I started eggs. Aww. He oinks <laughs> louder in my ear. You have to add the little oink because there's no oink. There was no oink. I'm not a big fan of the three little pigs, but Porky just blew my house down. That ain't. That ain't. <laughs> Porky slips out the closet and I stand there both breathless and in awe. Oh my god, I love Porky Pig. <laughs> I gotta give it to you. I stop. Sit down. That was, Sit down. It was actually really good. I love the wet fold. Oh, I didn't know what to call it. That was good. Oh. Like it. Grandchildren, what do y'all find? Cause this, this actually ate. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Yeah. I that bitch, I'm a lay yeah. I get the money, no lay I know you're just good. You was giggling too much. I'm like, you got something up in there. Mine's gonna be a little something. I'm going to read Zay's story, and he already has a title, so I already know it's better than mine. Okay, so this is called. <laughs> <laughs> so this story that Zay wrote is called The Darkwing Dussy. <laughs> I am not ready for take this. Take your time, take your time. Take my time, baby girl. <laughs> graduated college yesterday night at East Bay High. Today the air was windy, my feet were grounded, and I started feeling more and more of a somewhat adult. I haven't got a chance to do adult things yet. Backstory, I was a nerd in school. <laughs> it's the backstory. Backstory, I was a nerd. And every time I tried kissing a girl, girls would run twice as fast away from me, as if I would. As if I would, <laughs> as if I was running to. <laughs> Girl, what the f is you talking about? It's okay, it's okay. I got it. As if I was running to the monkey bars at recess. No one liked me. Suddenly, things in the sky started turning into a poopy <laughs> Thunder roars the sky as I look up in shock to what's happening or what's about to happen. As I close my eyes to blink once, a random dark figure gets thicker and broader in the sky. In that moment, I knew it was <laughs> Darkwing Duck. My pubes. <laughs> Why did you say that? I don't know. Okay, my pubes. <laughs> My pubes and my pants start to grow up. <laughs> Come back. No. Go back. No. You have to finish reading it. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Okay. My jaw hurts. My pubes and my pants start to grow longer. My orbs and my eyes start to get thicker and sharper in action. Hello, daddy's boy. Dark wing duck says in a bold tone. Hello. I say in a scared little boy's voice who just lost their puppy. He comes down in a purple cap and weird fishing type hat. <laughs> I'm in cape. <laughs> oh. I'm eat. The cape blows down with the wind as he puts two of his ducky feet on the ground. <laughs> it seems to me you haven't dropped those innocent. Yes. <laughs> See you. I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, sir, no one wants these innocent. <laughs> I say as I laugh to myself because the word balls is funny to me. <laughs> <laughs> he looks at me as if I'm a target. His ducky ocean orbs follow me from my blonde hair to my Converse shoes. He's Indie. He's Indie. He's Indie. Oh my gosh. Undress for me, boy. <laughs> um, sir? What does this man think I'm gonna be undressing for him without any context? <laughs> Do it now and I promise I'll give you a reward. I roll my eyes in scaredness and drop my pants and take off my shirt. I'm just in my ducky underwear that he stares and giggles to himself at. <laughs> that underwear too. I undress the underwear with my, you know, what showing and curly pubes out. Truth is I'm tired. What a monster I see. <laughs> this needs to be <laughs> Your voice. What do you mean, Mr. Darkwing? I say, it's Daddy Dark. <laughs> this is so good. It's Daddy Darkwing boy. Now get over here. I walk towards his direction and look at his black shorts that kind of startled me with a big <laughs> staring back at me. He puts his on my arms, making his way down to my monster throbbing. I let out a small moan, letting him know that it feels good. He 
to my baby old cats. Harder and harder as I start. And he starts to say, good boy, daddy likes. <laughs> <laughs> he magically potions us to his bedroom. Poof. It was super dark. <laughs> Nothing to see but his white orbs staring back at mine. <laughs> he continues to and down and massage the base of it. I scream as I get closer to, you know what? <laughs> I hate you. Do not do anything until I say so. I say, yes, daddy, dark wing. He <laughs> chokes me, bites me, quacks at me too. <laughs> what? He starts flipping me over while continuing to hit yeah. me like there was no tomorrow. <laughs> he licks his left middle finger and makes a quack. It startled me, but it was still hot. The same left middle finger he licked. He inserted it into my territory. I let out a sharp and punch it. <laughs> oh, punch it. Punch you did it. not. <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> Whoa there. As I turn back, he's smiling and quacks at me. I can't. No, but the quacking, the quacking additive is actually. Clever. Huh? It's, yeah, I'm adding points to this. Okay. <laughs> You. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're not Daddy Darkwing. He continues shoving. <laughs> the more he goes, the closer it gets to my spot. My body starts feeling quick waves of heat. My body aches. My body's shaking in nothing but pleasure. He props up one knee <laughs> on the bed and letting the other leg sit on the ground. I then feel his ducky <laughs> on my hole. I let out different moans. Slow, Daddy, slow. <laughs> I say, never even thinking it would come to this. He goes back and forth. <laughs> Starts picking up the base as my head goes in and out. He was my flame starter, and I just noticed that. He then continues to rip me off, but this time it's too late. It's all over his duck mouth and his sheets that I still have no idea what color it is. I'm sorry, I didn't know. I say, shut up, boy. <laughs> <laughs> this is like. I might need to put this. Actually, I want that. Like, upload this. Y'all actually read it. We can fix like a tweaking some stuff. Shut up, boy. I told you not to. He looks at me in disgrace, and I look back in sorrow. As I try to say another batch of apologies, he magically potions me back to real life with the short fall back on the ground. I look around to figure out my surroundings, and in that moment, I knew where I was, at East Bay High. Why would he potion me back here? The clouds go back to their hiding spot. Thunder quiets as it peaks back in time. I'm left staring at the school where I never got any action from anyone. My eyes appear up to a feather falling to the ground from the sky, and my voice, in a whispery, crackly sound, says, Me, we, me, yes! Dressed in like dark color, so he's going to be an antagonist. And you took that and you really made that come to life in this. <laughs> you know, writing this book, Heather, it was a time, you know. What inspired you to make him that uh, daddy figure? Why did I you think, make a softer one? I think because the way he looked in the photos. Mm -hmm. But that was very good. It was very well written. And I, I feel you. like for my story, I, I really should have taken my character. And no, I think that your characters are cool. I love even wrapping up the story. That you were so good though, then knocking on the door. I could like I love that type of reading. Like when you're reading and you can see it all in your head. When I was reading your story, I see it all in my head. I like saw this in my head. The potion. Can we upload this? We should. <gasps> Which, okay, if we uploaded it, y'all have to like, y'all need to talk about it. Y'all need to talk share, about it. Because this would be like. I like how there was more dialogue between the two characters though, because I feel like mine was just, they were in a closet just making out. And, like, they, they shared. But she was still giving like what was happening, and I can still see that. If you didn't give enough, then I would have been like missing. You were still saying like, wet folds. Oh, you were like putting your oh. fingers on the wet folds, like the wet kisses. I liked the action. Like you were still saying, and I feel like that's understandable because I feel like when people make out still, it's not so much talking. It's like just going. It's like okay, I yeah. feel like in this story they were rushing everything, but just like unzipping, skirt going. Yeah. I feel like mine was like more slow. To be honest, they're talking like a lot. No, but yours had a build up. Like yours was almost like scary, bro. The the poopy. <laughs> I okay. I don't. <laughs> At first when I was writing it, I, I put poopy green because I wanted it to be funny. Okay, yeah. And then I was like, actually, I should want this to be good. So yeah. I just left it and I never took it. I was going to say like... The imagery was good. I could see the clouds coming down. I could see the darkness. I don't know. I love writing. I know. I, I can love tell. writing too. It's so like... Should we... We should upload these. Do we upload? 
even like when you got grabbed in, like you were going through all these motions, you did not know what was happening. I can see like her body racing. <laughs> I can see her like, it's like, I can see oh the, the foot kicking. Like, I think you mastered this. You mastered yours. Give me your no, laptop. You mastered yours. Snatched waist was like, was good. Okay, I added that as a sure. joke too, but I was like, no, her waist is snatched. She's gonna be thick. One thing about Miss Tate is she thick. She's gonna be thick. And you'll know. You could plaster some of this on the back of a book and I'd actually be enticed to like read it. I started sweating, like I, have, I was, you know, laughing at first, but with the clouds suddenly coming dark and then the hello daddy's boy, I'm like, oh, like it He's, starts. Yeah. yeah, and we don't know who the character is. With mine, like I introduced who's who, mm -hmm. but with this one, it's like, you don't but know. But I love who stories like that though, because it gives me also room to give a vibe of how I want to characterize okay. them. Like you gave them names, you gave them a look, so I'm like, okay, I can see this type of person. I didn't really do that, but on, until one part, when I said the blonde hair and like the conversation, I didn't really describe. No, but I'm more of a person like I want to see them like blonde hair and like when a, like a blue top and blue jeans with Converse. I didn't do that. I just said blonde top. But that so lets the know. reader kind of put <laughs> we, their own. But like book. Reader. No, but seriously, are, that bro. lets the reader put their own spin on it. Like you know when you read books and you watch the movie adaptation and it's like I don't know how I appreciate the character. Yeah. Like with less description almost, it kind of lets me be as movie. creative as I want. Mm -hmm. So to me, I'm thinking of a scary like it is dark outside. I'm looking at them like who is this man coming down from the clouds? And he's flying in and he goes, hello daddy's boy. Hello daddy's boy. <laughs> like, that's that's really what I mentioned. I had the whole scenery of like my old, old neighborhood. You really? Yeah, I was like, I know this one street that I always like was kind of scared of. And like my mom would never let me go on that street. Okay. And like I could just see like my house right there and I'm on the street that my mom told me not to be like the skies like the, turning yeah. green. Yeah. And the clouds are coming together and like clashing. I kind of thought when I was reading, I thought it was going to be like, it was all just a dream or something. Like, I, like you woke up, but then he said, "May we meet again?" I'm like, "This is on purpose." Like, uh, uh they gonna meet again? They are going to part two. That was good. Well, well, that's a wrap. <laughs> this was supposed to be a joke, but I think. <laughs> I had so much fun. I had fun. Comment aspects of both stories that you liked and maybe some aspects that you would try to, that you would add to Incorporate, each. I was about to say that. Yeah, yes. to make it for improvement. Also, if y'all want to see like her or anybody like, you know, or any of her friends or even me, act them out, the that acting. might get a little risky. Hey. We're also about to film a video on this channel. Yeah, so it's go gonna be it. good, so just go watch it. I don't know when these will be uploaded or like if they're gonna be at the same time. I literally don't know. Should we try, and try to aim? Like to upload at the same time? No, like me. It's not going up till next year, girl. Uh, well, <laughs> no. mine would be up very soon. I'm very on top of it. He is. Subscribe to him, please. Um, if you want consistency, subscribe. subscribe to Zay. Oh, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Bye.